Hey YouTube, this is Pokedad, and today I'm showcasing the Fairy Toolbox. This is actually the fifth battle video uh, for this particular deck profile. So let's just go right in and hop into it. Uh, remember, this is the one that we use the Aromatis to transfer fairy energies, and we try to exploit our opponent's uh, weakness. So let's just see who we can get this time. Also, while we're loading, I do want to remind you about the contest. Uh, I'll have the link uh, to the contest below. Uh, so we're running that right now. And what in the world just happened? Okay. So we're going to pick heads, and it's going to be heads. Yes, we get to go first. So let's just get right into it. Okay. So our opponent mulligans, what is this? Some kind of plasma frost last, curse glare. Can't any special okay. Oh boy. We have a lot of special energy, so that could be a problem for us. So let's hit done. Alright, they mulligan again. Alright, and we're gonna play Shaman. That's what we got. That's not the greatest starter here. And unfortunately, Aromatisse is here too. Oh boy. We don't have any energy. Let's hope we draw into some energy. Okay. Uh, and it doesn't look like we did. Uh, so if he gets that guy out on turn one, we could be in real big trouble here. So let's just see. Let's start off. Uh. Alright, so I think we're going to play Fan Club. Uh, let's see here. Deoxys. He's playing Plasma type. I don't know. Let's, well, let's get, you know what, let's just go with our two that I think are the most important. So we're going to play, grab Spritzy, and let's grab Darkrai. And we'll hit done. Play them down. And man, we didn't draw into any energy. Let's attach a muscle band here. And we'll just in turn. I'm hoping we can get... Well, I don't know that I want to have a DCE. Uh, I need to really get a rainbow energy in play. At least one. Badly. But next turn, we'll at least get uh, Aro Aromatis out. Alright, he gets Snorunt. Professor's Letter here. Water Energy. Attaches a Water Energy, and he ends. Okay, he does in us, so we don't get... We still didn't get an Energy Drop. Wow. <sighs> okay. Um... Alright, we finally get an energy drop, but I'm not sure that's the energy I want to drop. I really need to try to get a rainbow energy in play. Uh, so let's... Let's play Xerneas down. Let's go ahead and play Charizard down. Uh, you know what? Let's undo that, that last action. I don't think I'm going to need Charizard. In this case, we'll go ahead and play Skyfield, and we're going to Sycamore here. Alright, we get a Toad, and we get a Rainbow Energy, so I'm going to go ahead and play uh, Rainbow Energy on Toad. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of Toad and the DCE here, and I'm going to grab Aromatis. All right, we'll play Aromatis down, and in turn. All right, now a lot of this, man, this is just not a great start for us. Okay, he has a crushing hammer. It fails. Let's see what he gets. Sycamore. Hypnotoxic laser. Alright, puts us to sleep. All 
All right, and we wake up. All right. Wow, we that was kind of clutch. All right, we've got We're going to play another Rainbow Energy on uh Seismitoad. We're going to AZ our shaman, put up Seismitoad, and we'll play shaman down and draw five cards. All right. Uh at this point I think it would be best to play, let's see, what do we need? These guys are weak to metal. Hmm, Jirachi? I don't know that I want to use Jirachi guys, though. So let's just play Evil Tall. It's a solid card, and I don't know what I'm going to Ultra, uh, I don't know what I'm going to VS Seeker for yet. So I'm just going to Quaking Punch here, I'll hit for 30, and let's see where we go from here. All right, Wally. All right, that probably means yes, this guy's out, so n we can't play. As long as he's in the active, we can't play any more special energies. All right, he hits for 60, and he hits all of us for 10. That is pretty amazing. All right, now let's think about this. So he's weak to metal. He's only 90 though. Let's see, so if we hit him for 30. But if we use evil evil tall, actually we can use dark rye here. Right? And dark rye will knock him out and then we can go ahead and start so let's do that. Let's uh let's I want to go ahead and play another dark rye and let's go ahead and get Manetric down too. We're going to attach to dark rye. We're going to retreat into the dark rye and then we're going to fairy transfer these to dark rye. And we'll hit done. Then we're going to go ahead and uh, VS Seeker here. Let's go ahead and grab the Colrus. And we'll Colrus for a lot. Now we got Malamar. Let's put Malamar down. And I don't want to play. I, I'm going to go ahead and play the uh, Max Potion on Seismitoad. And then let's just Night Spear here, knocking him out. And let's continue to put damage on the Deoxys there so we got rid of him and so we can now play that other rainbow energy down if we want to he's gonna laser us we do go to sleep let's just see he's gonna crushing hammer okay tails fortunately he ends all right another Deoxys and he changes the stadium on us. Okay. Well, we don't need Shaman, so let's go ahead and get rid of Shaman. Uh, we're not going to really need Xerneas in this matchup. Um, okay. And we have a Dark Rye already, but I really want to keep this one just in case. Uh, so let's see. Let's. I think we're going to get rid of Manetric. Alright, he's got the training center, which, okay, well, there we go. Each stage one gets plus 30 HP in stage two. Alright, and unfortunately we stay asleep here. That's not good for us. Uh, let's see, I feel like though, I don't know that I want to play this on Malamar. Uh, I feel like, let's play it on Evil Tall. And I would have liked to put him to sleep, but I just want to get Evil Tall ready. And just in case something major comes up, let's go ahead and fairy transfer this stuff off. We can always transfer it back somewhere else. So let's put uh, the other two on Seismitoad, and we'll hit Done. Uh, we'll go ahead and Colrus here. All right, and I don't need the stadium just yet. So let's just in turn here. All right, we're still asleep, so we're still taking poison damage. But at least he doesn't have any energy. And if we need to, we can always put moving energy up and retreat him. So we're just fine right here. Actually, I like our position. Uh, he does VS Seeker here. And he's probably going to get the end, so he's going to probably drop us back down to five. Yep, that's okay, though. I'm still not uh, disappointed with our 
uh, match it. I think we're still looking very good. All right, he hits us for 70 and hits all of these for 10. All right, and we finally wake up. All right, so I feel like the best thing to do here is just... Um, hmm. Okay, we can't play the special energy because he's in the active. So why don't we just fairy transfer? I'm gonna move one of these to Darkrai. This will then allow us to retreat into the other Darkrai. Then we're gonna fairy transfer. Uh you know what? Oh, that might have been a misplay, guys. Um uh, alright, we'll play this here. And we'll go ahead and just put all these up. We do have the max potion though, so we'll go ahead and max potion. And uh, at this point, I don't want to really do anything else. So we'll Night Spear. Now he still does, he's not going to be dead, but we can continue to whittle down on this Deoxys here. Uh, all right, and I still like our, our position here. He Colrus Machines here. He's got another one he's getting ready to go with. Okay, he's down to 10 cards already. Crushing Hammer. Hits Tails again. He's got another Crushing Hammer. That's his last one. Finally it hits. And he gets rid of one of the rainbows. No problems though. Hey, right, computer searches here. What else is he going to get? Man. Did he get an energy drop? Is that what he did? Alright, he hits for 10 here on all of us. Okay. <sighs> Alrighty, so I've got 19 cards here. I wouldn't mind having another fairy energy. Uh, so let's just grab Colrus again we can at least drop an, a fairy energy here and we do get the fairy energy drop so let's go ahead and attach it uh, actually it's not going to matter actually we might just want to let's just cancel that because we might be able to use it for next turn so we're going to retreat just into evil tall we're going to fairy transfer up uh, that the rainbow energy and we'll just evil ball here or do we want a Y Cyclone? Let's Y Cyclone uh, to Seismitoad. I don't want him to play like a Team Flare Grunt and knock that off. I'm okay with him knocking the DCE off, but the Rainbow Energy is really valuable to us. So, And we've already lost one, so he's going to end again. Ends us down to four. Okay. Uh... He hits us again. All right, so we're at a hundred for Evil Tall. Let's see. He he has a hundred and twenty because of this. So we're hitting for. He's got twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, a hundred. All right. So I just need to move. Let's see. Twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, a hundred, and then twenty. So all I need to do, and actually I don't even need that. I can just change the stadium. Uh, I think I'm going to lay down Jirachi here and hit yes. And he concedes, guys. So I think he knew, saw the, the writing on the wall. He knew we were going to knock out his last attacker there. And his Deoxys weren't really doing anything. So there you go. That's the fifth and final battle. Uh, fifth battle is a rogue deck, guys, so I hope you uh, enjoy, and uh, check out the deck profile. Also, I have the contest in the description, the video for the contest. Anyway, hit like, subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, put in the comments, tell me what your favorite Pokemon from this deck is, since we have such a wide variety, uh, and uh, we'll talk to you later, guys. Bye.